Okay, what's playing out within the Congress? The race for the post to be the next Congress president is heating up. The election will be held on October 17th. The results will be declared after counting on October 19th. The dates were finalized at the Congress Working Committee meet, which was held earlier today, uh, earlier yesterday, I beg your pardon, uh, under the chairmanship of Congress Interim Chief Sonia Gandhi. The election will be notified on September 22nd, and the date for filing the nomination will be between September 24th and 30th. The last date of withdrawal of a nomination will be October 8th. The meeting uh, took place in the shadow of the resignation of senior Congress leader Gulam Nabi Azad, who in his resignation letter named, shamed and blamed Rahul Gandhi and his style of functioning. Gulam Nabi Azad had called Rahul Gandhi childish. He had called him immature and blamed him for the Congress party's loss in the 2014 general elections. He also blamed Rahul Gandhi for sidelining senior leaders and creating a coterie of inexperienced sycophants to court Mr. Azad. Isme sirf jo election kab hona chahiye aur nomination kab hoga president ka aur uske liye kya kya tayari ya hai wo mesri saab ne bata hai madhusudan mesri saab ne sare congress workers ki ye bhavna hai ki Rahul Gandhi ji is wakt lead le aur wo congress president bane क्योंकि वो एक ही कांग्रेस पार्टी को जुटा भी सकते हैं कांग्रेस पार्टी को उठा भी सकते हैं दे बी आवर ओनली वन पॉइंट एजेंडा वाज द टू फाइनलाइज द कांग्रेस प्रेसिडेंट इलेक्शन शेड्यूल व्हिच हैज बीन अप्रूव्ड बाय सी बाय सी डब्ल्यू सी टुडे सर्टेनली सर्टेनली मेजॉरिटी ऑफ द कांग्रेस वर्कर्स वांट राहुल गांधी एज अ प्रेसिडेंट बट इट इज अप टू हिम टू टेक अ डिसीजन ऑन दैट so these elections, which several other political parties have said is a complete sham, will happen in fact on October 17th. That's the decision that's been taken at the Congress Working Committee meet as well. But will there be the same chorus, the same talk about Rahul Gandhi essentially becoming the next Congress president, despite what Gulam Nabi Azad said last week? That remains the question. Supriya Bhardwaj joins us live from Delhi with more details on this. Supriya, round up for us uh, all of the takeaways from the CWC meet yesterday. Well, as far as the CWC meet is concerned, Akshita, the Congress party has thrown its weight behind uh, the Gandhi sign. What we are hearing from the senior party leaders as well as uh, also the other uh, workers and various other quarters, they are saying that uh, they will be once again urging to Rahul Gandhi that he should take up the mantle. Also, the Congress party is maintaining uh, that uh, as far as the CWC election is concerned, there will be three major scenarios. First being that of uh, a situation where an election takes place that is going to take place on 17th of October when there are more than two candidates. The second being that of uh, a situation where no one files uh, the nomination and uh, then the third one will be where only one person files the nomination. Now what we are hearing from the Congress quarter is that though the elections have been announced, but top uh, senior leaders as well as the workers are going all out and there's a clamor for Rahul Gandhi to take up the post of the Congress uh, party's uh, presidentship. But as far as the Gandhi sign is concerned, he has maintained stock silence. The last uh, time in CWC when it took place uh, earlier in this year was his stand was very clear that whatever uh, of, uh, responsibility the party is going to give him, he will actually ensure that he uh, you know, performs it well. At the same time, also, he had maintained and asked to take up uh, the uh, president's post. He has said that he will look into the matter, he will consider. Okay. But so far, he hasn't opened up the cards. Well, as far as the Congress is concerned, they have started a new era, a new dawn has started. Whatever may be the result, the Congress will certainly get into the next phase of the transition, which is the implementation of that entire Chintan Shivar declaration right. which took place in Udaipur. Okay, Supriya, thank you for those details. The rhetoric essentially of the Rahul Gandhi for Congress chief uh, chant has already kicked off within the Congress.